Hey Pioneers, this is the pin loaded leg press. It's seated, so you're gonna make sure that you're sitting pretty upright and that means that your butt and back have to stay on the mat. So butt stays down, head and upper back stay on the mat. If there's a natural curve in your spine, that's okay. We want to adjust weight for what is appropriate for us. General rule of thumb, close to your body weight for eight to 10 reps is a good place to start. So for me, about 130 pounds. And if I need to adjust by five pound intervals and not larger intervals, instead of using the pin, I can use these knobs to add more plates. When I sit down, I can then pull this lever up and then push myself up to find a comfortable position. We want about 90 degrees in the hips, 90 degrees in the knees, and your foot width can be whatever is comfortable for you, provided your whole foot stays on the platform. About shoulder width with a little bit of toe out is perfectly okay. Lower is not always better if it causes form breakdown in other places. So head, back, and butt all staying on the mat. Almost 90 degrees here and here. Feet flat on the platform. I'm gonna inhale, exhale and press without locking my knees like that. Do not do that. I'll come back down with control. Press up with control. This works all of the muscles in your legs. So the quadriceps, hamstrings, glute muscles, outer thigh, inner thigh because it's a leg press, like our plate loaded. So that's the pin loaded leg press.